No! Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. The dog said that I should meet him. Yes. This looks to be Hamar Shane. Who was that I saw up here? Hello, sir? Sir? Sir! Alright, well, you don't seem to be hostile. Alright, well, I'm here at Hamar Shane. I encountered a talking dog outside of Falkreath, separated from his master. I figured I should come and help. I'm here alone. Gorbash wanted to spend some time with his family, and I somehow feel like I might be strong enough to handle Huh? Uh-oh. Any sort of problems I encounter, we'll see. Got you. I just need to take it slow. What a... A vampire thrall? Good sign. Is someone there? I knew it. Oh, she's already dead. sneak. Still not down. There! Oh. Right, I have gotten more powerful.
thought the dog was supposed to meet me. What? Oh, well, hopefully I'll find him. Oh, look at all this blood. No! Oh, more blood. All right, what's in here? Scroll of Frozen Orb. A spinning orb that slowly travels to the target location and hovers there for three seconds, spraying spikes, ice spikes. Okay. That might be helpful. Take this. Take these books to put them on display in the Dragonborn Gallery. someone dead probably feasted on by a vampire and is an, he's an imperial just like me all right now it's personal I better sneak some more Steps. There. What? This was a tough vampire. I think I've got enough Apothis armor. I've, I even put some on display in the museum. Um, let's just go ahead and try to pick this. Start sneaking again. I've been working on sneaking. In fact, I've done some things that I'm not so proud of. Like stealing a statue of Debella from the temple in Markarth. I don't know why I did it. Maybe I'm just bored. As being the Archmage, I need more excitement in my life. Maybe that's why I'm sneaking around in this cave full of vampires without a bodyguard all right let me go behind them okay oh now now they're facing me all right let's let's go this way i know when i go this way they'll probably turn the other way I've even enchanted these clothes to give me the ability to sneak. Look, they don't even know mine here. Got you! That's a full ring mail 
set of armor. The only thing I don't have is muffle. But hopefully, the enchantment on these clothes is enough. <laughs> oh. Probably got most of these books, but you can never be too careful. I think last I looked, we had close to 300 items on display in the uh, Dragonborn Gallery. Hmm, a bandit. The Pirate Saber. Hmm. It looks like this is the way. Yes, Hamar Shame. Is that noise? Oh, it's a spider. I should have known. All right. I'm going with fire this time. Got you. Someone's up here. Wow, they certainly have a lot of salt here. <gasps> wow, 
These enchantments really work. People aren't seeing me or detecting me. There's only one thing I can do, and that's take potions. To increase my magic until I can find a... a spell... that doesn't drain me so completely. Now you don't want to talk, huh? Whatever. Alright, it looks like I need to activate this shrine. Lord Vile, I have a request of you. By all means, let's hear it. It's the least I could do, since you already helped me grant one final wish for my last worshippers. They were suffering so from vampirism and begged me for a cure. Then you came and ended their misery. I couldn't have planned it better myself. So, what's your heart's desire? What kind of deal can we strike? Actually, I don't think we can strike a deal. If your idea of curing vampirism is to have me slay the vampire, I don't think we see eye to eye. Anyhow, I'm just here to reunite you with Barbus. Ah, uh, that insufferable pup! Forget it! Request denied! No deal! I'm glad to be rid of him. Even if it you don't does mean that. Mean I'm Stuck in this pitiful shrine in the back end of nowhere. Well, perhaps there is a way he could earn his place back at my side. Maybe, but no promises. All right, then, what's your offer? 
There's an axe. An incredibly powerful axe. An axe powerful enough for me to have quite a bit of fun indeed. If you bring it to me, I'll grant you my boon. No strings attached, no messy surprises. At least not for you. As I recall, it's resting in Rhyme Rock Burrow. Barbers can lead you right to it. Little Mutt might even earn his place back at my side. All right then. I suppose I have no choice but to get this axe. Oh, and here's a chest too. Barbus, let's go. Oh, what are those Imperials down there? I'm here with my horse, Dr. Bombay. And Barbus. Let's see if we can't find this axe. Come on. I don't know, but it's amazing how Dr. Bombay can just climb up all these, uh... Mountains. What is this? Have I been here? I haven't. It's another one of those strange walls with the writing that I can't read. It's not even showing up on the map, though. <gasps> no! Dr. Bombay and Barbus. So, this is Volsung. What? Prices are 20% better? Carry capacity increased by 20% by 20 points and, and can breathe underwater. Okay, well. It'll certainly look nice on display at the Dragonborn Gallery. Alright, let's continue on. Alright, this is Rimrock or Rhyme Rock Burrow. Alright, Dr. Bombay, you wait for me here. certainly get to practice sneaking today. At least I don't have one of the followers with that heavy armor that's always clanking and making all sorts of noise. Oh boy, what is this? Oh, a flame atronach.
nothing like a little sleet storm to stop a flame, Atronach. You know, uh-oh. All right, we're gonna use sleet on him as well. Oh! Farmers, you idiot! run in front of me when I'm casting spells. All right, we've destroyed whoever this is. Sebastian Lort? Hmm. Oh, look at this. A steel dagger of sparks. Robes of ruination. Well, we'll take that. And these black mage boots. I've been looking for a pair of black boots. Okay. Well, let me just see if there's anything that I can unenchant. I think we're good. This looks like the the axe. The rueful axe. Scroll of Conjure Familiar. Alright, let's go. Oh. Dr. Bombay, be careful! living dangerously. All right, let's get back to Clavicus Vile. Ah, you've got the axe. And my dog. Splendid. Yes, we are back. Now fulfill your end of the bargain. Excellent work. A hero and his faithful companion retrieving the ancient artifact for the prince. It's almost... Storybook. Ah, oh, but it almost seems a shame to give a weapon like that away, doesn't it? I suppose I could be persuaded to let you keep it. But only if you use the axe to kill Barbus. Simple as that. Well, you're lucky that I am a mage. I have no interest in this axe. So no deal. Take the axe and take back Barbus. Huh. You're no fun at all. Guess I'll have to make my own fun elsewhere. And with the pup back, I'll be restored to my full power. There's a whole world just waiting for me! <laughs> I knew I could trust you. Yeah, yeah, dog gets master, master gets cosmic axe. Everyone's happy. Just get over here, mutt. Don't worry, I'll make sure he sees the light. I trusted you, now you trust me. Okay. <gasps> what? so much. Oh my goodness. You forget how nice supreme power feels until you've been stuck in a cave for a few years. It's a shame you wished for something so dull as me taking back the mutt. Quite the lack of imagination on your part. A lack of ambition like that really ought to be punished. Perhaps by turning you into a worm. Or maybe a few decades of... Oh, fine. Have my boon and be done with it. Got more interesting deals to make anyway. All right, then. It looks like I'm done here.
right, so Barbus is back where he belongs. And let me just check out this mask that I was given. Here, the mask of Clavicus Vile. Prices and bribes are 38% better, and almost all persuasion attempts will be successful. Well, I'm going to see who else I can help to try to make up for the dark deeds that I've done with stealing. And You see that I'm wearing black. I, I don't know what, what that means. Maybe I'm becoming evil? 